guys this is beat the trends and for today i'd like to feature my new printer so the brand is canon and it's a canon g4010 series so it's four in one guys and really this is costly but i still buy because i really need to print modules so before anything else i'd like to feature this uh, printer so it is canon and then i buy this one because i really want to print modules and the good thing is it is four in one so i could use it to print i could also use it to fax copy and then scan documents so as you can see okay let me take a closer look at the printer so as you can see in this part, it has start button, and then it has color button, and then stop button. So this light, this is the power button. So once the printer is turned on, so this light will show up. So if I'm going to turn it off, and then you'll see that this light will um, turn off okay so that's it so i'll turn it on because i'll be using this one okay so see it's turning on okay and then you can see right here that there's a certain um details on the screen of the printer so okay so this one this is our logo when we want to photocopy a document and then this one is for fax and then this one is for the scanning and this one is the menu so if we want to um what do we call this if we wanted to set the page if we wanted to reduce or enlarge what we wanted to photocopy we'll just need this and then it will take us to what we needed to do okay so for today i'd like to let you know that i already tried photocopying a certain document from this printer and then i had seen that it's good because it can print fast so i did printed 15 copies in just five minutes so this is really nice so i don't need to take much time just to um, wait until I'm done printing so anyway for you to find out let's watch and see how this printer works so wait let me introduce to you first so right here this is the place where we're going to place our bent paper and then this one is for the photocopying so if you wanted to photocopy long size or legal size documents we just need to place it right here and then it will goes out right here so it will goes out right here and then that's it so if we wanted to photocopy long this is the part where we need to put the document we wanted to photocopy and then if we're going to photocopy short or a for size we just need to open this one okay so this is very nice and i want you to know that it's really hard to buy a printer that's in good quality these days because most of the printers are sold out and maybe if there's a printer especially secondhand printers there might be problems in it so i'm glad that i still have this one so okay let's start and see um, how many minutes will I need to consume if ever I'm going to print on if ever I'm going to photocopy so let's find out okay guys so the first thing that I wanted to do is that I'd like to print a module so before anything else I wanted to tell you a tip that if ever you're going to print we need to fan the papers because it will help us avoid paper jumps because sometimes the printer will eat two sheets of bent paper so it will cause paper jumps and then to avoid it we just need to fan so it will separate from each other 
so that's it they already fan it so it's now ready to be placed in our tray okay so i'm placing it in our tray okay so i'm done placing the paper on the tray and now i'd like to print module so let us check if how many seconds must we consume if ever we're going to print using the printer okay as you can see i'll be printing music module number 10 and then it has actually it has 10 pages so i'm using the odd and even portion so i'll print it back to back so okay i'm trying to print the um even numbers so let me type two four six eight and then ten okay so in our printer i need to print just one copy because i need i'll just photocopy it because it's much um good to photocopy it because it's much better and it's faster so okay so i'm printing two four six and eight so the page is two four six and eight so let's check if how many seconds will it take for printing five pages okay so let's start okay i'm trying to change the page um page size i mean the size the paper size so from a4 i'll change it to um lego size and then i set it to fit the printable area so since um the paper we're using is 8.5 by 13 and then the legal size is 8.5 by 14 so i change it to um 96 percent so it could fit to the printable area okay so i'm using the black and white color so i don't need to use much ink for the colored ink so okay let's start okay you check if how many seconds will it consume for printing five pages as you notice i didn't i didn't um set up the printer right here because um it will just automatically print you don't need to set up if you will just go to print you don't need to set up this one because it's automatic unless you're going to photocopy it needs um it needs to be set up So that's it it's printing sorry for us it's so messy okay how many do we have one two three four and five okay so it's so okay so we're done so it's so fast and you don't need to wait much mm, compared to my old printer i need to wait much but let's check and find out what's the difference okay so i already printed the um the pages that are even so i'm trying to use the side b of the bin paper so i'll print right here the odd pages of the module okay so right now i'm ready to print the add pages so i have your one three five seven and nine so let's print it and check how many seconds
Okay, it's all done. And as I've counted, we consume 40 seconds to print 5 pages. So, as I noticed, if we're going to print and then there are parts of the document that needs to have a something like this that need, uh, requires much ink or mostly pictures it takes time to let the printer print it fast because um it's not it's not like a text that you just need to uh easily print it this one it takes time so that's why we took um 40 seconds to print five pages but still it's a good it's a good um it's a good quality because it's still fast it's still fast and hmm, i wanted you to know that i am using l120 epson printer and then the printer is defective right now because it usually eats the bent paper um, i'm using uh, same quality as this bent paper 70 gsm um, I don't know why the printer is eating the paper, but I'm glad that I buy this new printer. I just recently buy it and then I found out that it's nice. So, okay, so we spent 40 seconds to print the um, add pages of the module. So, 40 seconds plus 40 seconds on its side A, so we consume. Um, 80 seconds 80 seconds for the five pages so 80 seconds for five pages it's um, one minute and 20 seconds so let's find out if we'll consume one minute and 20 seconds if we are going to photocopy this document so okay let's find out okay so since we're going to photocopy so i'll be using this part of the printer okay so we need to place the papers right here and then it will goes out right here okay so the documents that we are going to photocopy um especially when it's on legal size we need to place it right here and then the printer will scan it and then it will goes out right here and then the photocopy document will goes out right here this one this one so the photocopied document will um goes out right here so okay let's check it okay so first thing is i'd like to photocopy this one so i'll photocopy okay so right now i'm going to photocopy a legal size paper so since it's legal size so i just place it right here and then as you can see on the screen of our printer it says a4 the pa uh, paper size is a4 so we need to change it so first we need to click this one the photocopy button and then um, okay it says copy mode and then we need to we need to set this one so we need to um, copy mode and then we need to click the menu and then we need to find um, the page a uh, paper size so we need to um, okay so we found it page size and then we need to click okay and then we need to change a4 to legal size so legal size okay we found it legal okay so we, after finding the legal size we need to click okay and then um we just need to press this one the back button and then as you can see it says 100 percent legal okay so i'd like to print um at least one page only because i wanted to compare how much seconds it takes to photocopy compared to printing the document so okay let's try 
okay so I'm going to since it's already set to one page I'm going to click right here the button so if you're going to print it in black you just need to press this button and if you want it colored so you just need to press this one and then if you wanted to stop photocopying so you just need to click the stop button okay I'll repeat if you wanted to photocopy the printed document into black we just need to press this button and if you wanted to photocopy it in color so we just need to press this button and if you wanted to stop photocopying just need to press this one okay so let's start so I'm trying to um, click the black so wait a minute okay so let's start So as you can see, I place all the pages right here, so um, it will eat each of the pages and then I will proceed to photocopying. Oh, so I forgot to check how many seconds, so I'm just going to check it out after my um, coverage. Okay it's, all, okay, it's all done. So we already have five photocopied um, documents. So since I'm going to use the side B of the paper, so I'm just going to, you know, um, place this again on the tray. So let me place it on the tray. Oh, sorry. I hit the phone I'm using so I'm sorry okay so let me place this one on the tray okay that's it and I already placed it so this time we are going to photocopy the Okay, this part. So we need to photocopy this part. Okay, let's check what we photocopied. So we photocopied the um, even pages. So now we're, we need to photocopy the add pages. So right now I'm going to check how many seconds did we spend for photocopying the pages, the five pages document. So ready? Let's start. Okay, we're done. So as I counted, we consumed 70 seconds to photocopy the five pages of this module. So 
Upon photocopying, I noticed that we only consume 70 seconds to photocopy the 5 pages of the mode show. So, 70 seconds plus 70 seconds on its side A. So, we consume um, 140 seconds. So, it's equivalent to um, 1 minute and 40 seconds. So, a while ago, we printed the document and we... Um, we consume 80 seconds to print just the even side of the document. So, 80 seconds versus 70 seconds. So, photocopying is much faster compared to printing the document. But still, as you can notice, the, the photocopy quality is just the same as printing it so it's really nice so for those who would like to buy um printer um i'm not really i'm not really an uh, expert on advisories but i'd like to i just like to let you know that i love the printer i just buy and i guess it can help me with my problem because I really I recently have a problem of printing the module so right now I'm so blessed that I have it and for those who would want to buy this one um, um, this printer is Canon Canon the brand is Canon and it's Canon G4010 and then if you wanted to ask what are the freebies so the only freebies is this one um, it has a, a desk um, a desk so you need to install this one um, installer for the printer so this is our brand the Canon G4010 okay so it's four in one we could use it to print we could use it to fax to photocopy and then to scan documents so this is Jocelyn I mean okay so this is beat the trends and thank you for watching see you in my next video bye